Okay, so so here we go. Um, we get we can have our tutorial now. So our tutorial is about um, Firebug. Firebug is an is a web development tool tracer. So it could be very helpful when you are uh, building websites so you can trace codes so you can edit them okay so I will show you how it works okay so first of all you need to have Firefox since it is a <coughs> a very compatible working on Firefox it is an add-on so I will show you how to do it you click tools and click add-ons okay so here you can see get add-ons and you click this one up here okay search all add-ons paste your cursor and then type firebug okay and then search okay you will see firebug extension here need to add it to your firefox so click add to firefox okay so accept and install okay it it says that you need to restart oh sorry you need to install okay install now installing it is cycling for for a few seconds need to wait for for it to finish installing okay okay so restart Firefox click on it so we need to wait for Firefox to load again okay it's cool now close so you can see here the logo firebug logo here okay so let me have an example on how to do it how to use firebug building a website I have a free template here so we um, we will use it as our example okay I will find it on my computer oh I guess it's not here downloads um, okay we will use this okay we're gonna use this one HTML okay okay so this is it <coughs> firebug okay when using firebug it can trace what is exact <coughs> images or um, stuff here so I will show you how it works click this one a little bug here something like cat roach I don't know what it is okay so click that one click an element here click this one you need to point it something in there so <coughs> as you see in the header it is when you click that it is this one 
is located on images and his name is m11.jpg so images when you locate the one here images m11 we will look for that <coughs> m11 here so you see we can uh, we can trace directly using firebug okay more about firebug okay so this one you need to edit new products to shall we say latest products okay how to do it how to do that click here click new products okay so we cannot change it into text because it is a picture now we will look for we will look for another okay here gifts for him pets okay that was an index that HTML so index that HTML I need to right click edit with notepad plus plus should find um, control F control F to find uh, find window appears and you're gonna type pets or pet hit find next so once you click on this button right here it would um, highlight the word that you are that you are searching or looking for so this is one so we need to close this edit this shall we say you have a soap you are having a store soap okay so store soap so <coughs> your product is uh, shall we say whitening soap save sorry or shall we say a specific um, specific title of the soap uh, placenta shall we say placenta so we need to hit save on it okay so when you refresh the page So you see this one? Placenta. Okay. Okay then for example, okay. For the sake of this example, we need I was going to change the whole stuff. All products copy control F. find next okay okay something like that so here go to clear placenta so if we're going to um, so now okay 
so the work of firebug is to teach you where, where this images here located in the directory if you do not know so click firebug click then inspector this is a header says m11 so when you highlight this one so it highlighted the whole header so it means that is the cover that yeah that covers all the header m11 so inspect again home what it what is home then the file name of home so when you click that one you can see this home.jpg so you can it is located in images folder and it, the name of the picture is home.jpg so you can uh, you can I call this one up here you can detect where is that picture located okay okay something like this one what is the name of this picture it is fc1.jpg under images folder okay so firebug helps you to helps you a lot on building website okay. this one up here up here this 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 okay for example the click here button it is different with this 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 so with this picture we do have four dimensions this one two three four so if you are confused of where it is you can inspect them for example this one you need to click on it and inspect okay him to that jpg under images folder here you can find it here images him one I, sorry him two okay so this so firebug is a tracer so yeah fabric is good okay so you do have now an idea what fabric can can help you through your web development projects okay so that's all and I hope this tutorial could help you or can or you get something or some ideas on how to use firebox thank you